What's up divas and divos? It's your girl April. You guys already know that. So we're just going to get right into this. We're about to pop on this wig real quick. If you guys are not familiar with Eva Wigs, I will post their information below. But I have worked with them numerous times in the past, present, future, whatever you want to call it. I have worked with them. So yes, you guys, I hope you all are having like an amazing day. So the wig that they sent me, I actually had a custom unit made because I wanted something totally different. You guys know I love my density. Like I like a lot of hair. I like it full. And I really don't know why I'm yelling. Like seriously, I really don't know why the heck I'm yelling. But anyway, so um, I got a custom unit and it is 150% density. You know I like it long, so it's, um, it's 22 inches. I was about to say 122 inches. If it was that damn long, a girl would not be able to be wearing it. Okay, seriously. So it is a loose wave. It's virgin. I think it's Brazilian hair, but I will post all of it below. It's not a 360. It's not a lace front. It's a um, a glueless full lace wig. So you know, with the full lace wig, you can part it wherever you want. In the middle, on the side, in the front, to the back, to the left, whatever you want to do, you can do it. You can put it up in a high bun, a low bun, whatever you want to do, a ponytail, a side ponytail, a side piece. It's all up to you guys. Um, me personally, I don't really do like too many um, like high buns or anything like that just because it just is a lot of work and I'm not really into doing all the extra work so you know you know it is what it is you know what I'm saying so this one like I said was a loose wave and it's a glueless full lace wig it does have the three combs in the front and oh true I didn't even notice like there was no comb in the back ah uh, ah uh, okay well I guess um, I would just have to sew my own on it. I would take this middle one out and put it back here because I don't even use these middle combs. Like they are such a nuisance to me. They really don't help the cause. Like seriously, they don't really help any cause. But it does have the adjustable straps in the nape, but and also it got this handy dandy elastic. Now, I'm not really sure where I got this elastic from. I know it came with like another wig company, but you could actually get these from Walmart. I did get some from Walmart that looks identical to this. So you can get these from Walmart for like a dollar, sometimes like 97 cents. So definitely check Walmart out for these. Um, I would definitely pick up black. Sometimes, I mean, like at certain Walmarts, they never restock, but white is the same as well. But if you can find black, definitely get them and make sure they're wide enough, okay? But I did wash it. Um, and the color that I have is a number two because you know like I like my hair to match my own natural hair um, even though it's gonna be on my head and you're not gonna see it I do like it to kind of like match so I'm gonna take these adjustable straps oh my god should have prepared myself for this um, so I did tweeze some of the um, wig the hairs the hairs looked a little bit um swollen they were a little bit big for my taste you know what i'm saying but we all we all entitled to how we feel so the box does come like this there's a wig cap and a comb inside of it i'm pretty sure you guys know what that looks like so you know it's nothing different so i always have my wig concealer on here i prefer to use this for my wig so i'll just call it my wig concealer because that's the only purpose i use it for so i'm gonna take a little bit of this wig concealer and this wig concealer brush and I'm going to tell y'all about the wig. Let's do this.
okay yes bitch yes yes all right so first of all let's just get into the whole construction of it so the only thing that i'm gonna suggest because i really was not happy with the is it wasn't like okay so like i had to pull this wig back further um past my hairline as opposed to like right here because it kind of like would not lay flat and i'm not really sure if that's a fault of my own i did try the wig on prior to adding the elastic and it still fit like that when i first cut the lace off of it or what have you and i was kind of like hmm maybe it'll lay flatter once i cut more lace as well as add the elastic maybe that'll kind of like bring it in but it seems like to me like this wig wants me to pull it further down past my hairline like in front of my hairline and I'm not really up for all of that because I just really don't like the wig to be right here on my forehead I just I don't I don't really like to do that that's you know yeah that's not like really for me so I don't really like to do that so I try to make it look as natural as possible so it is like right here in the middle and then like on the sides it's back like right here which is fine because I mean I have my own hair that is baby haired out so you really can't tell but either way I had to kind of like do my own thing with it kind of like make it work for me and I guess that's with every wig you gotta make it work for you what works for you may not work for me but as for the wig quality it's a really good quality the hair is gorgeous I love the 150 density honestly this 150 density it doesn't even seem like it's 150 density like honestly it feels like it's like 200 density because I have done so many wigs in my life and one company's 150 ain't the other company's 150 you'd be like 150 girl please where's the rest of the hair <sighs> listen let me tell you I've had these issues before in my lifetime but their 150 density is totally like okay you get you some hair you getting like getting some hair the color number two is so pretty like okay it's natural looking it looks so natural like I like that I like it the only issue I had is that I had to pull it back some but that's all right though because I already have my own baby hair is ready right to go situated so I wasn't really too concerned about anybody else baby hairs and I just really don't like the wig all the way down here like some people it's good for them what's good for the goose ain't good for the gander all the time and I'm the MF gander and I don't want to be wearing my wig all the way down here like that might be good for you but April ain't gonna do that okay so yes I really did not want to use this because I already have my hair situated but as for this gorilla snot gel I hate the name they need to take the word snot out of it this stuff really does work I like this stuff like let me tell y'all about my baby hairs like I will use this first on my baby hairs to like style them just like this and then I will come through with just a little bit of this on top of it and let me tell you I will leave them like this for three days they will not move I will just leave them like this for three days of course I'm putting a scarf on at night but for real it will stay down like this for three days without having to redo it so shout out to the Moco, Moco de Gorilla Gorilla Snagia I don't know if this is like Spanish or is it just because I bought it out here but either the way either the way it is some good stuff okay and like I said this is a custom unit the quality is really good 22 inches baby glueless full lace wig and it is virgin hair and she looks really pretty y'all know how I feel about loose weight hair like I love it I love it because if you really don't want to put style in it all you gotta do is wash it and then poof be gone you you done like I, I like wavy hair like this because I think it's exotic and I love to be exotic but if you want to flat iron it or put a curl style in it by all means you could do so because it's a nice silky texture but eight point into all of that so I just like to wear it like this so yes you know what I'm saying a lot of my waves is like loose wavy I am that loose kind of girl oh well maybe mm, I shouldn't have said that yeah so yes you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. I will see you in a soon to come video. All of the information for Evil Wigs will be posted for you guys below. I love you guys. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs this video up because you love me so much. As much as I love you guys and I'll see you in a soon to come video. Bye.